Hi, Julia from Drawfee. How are you? Hi, I'm super, super good right now. How are you? I'm doing well. We just did some stuff in New York. We just did a live show together, which was a lot of fun. That was so much fun. Now Drawfee, or one part of Drawfee, is coming onto my channel to do a little drawing collab here. Thanks for doing that. I'm excited to draw things. <laughs> Well, thank you for having me. I'm actually really excited for this idea that you brought up to me. Yeah, so I saw on Twitter, somebody said, just had an idea for a horrible art game. I disagree that it's horrible. I like it a lot. One artist draws something and then makes it a silhouette, gives this to the other artist who doesn't know what the actual drawing is, and then they have to make a drawing within the silhouette based on what they think it is. And then we get to compare the old version and the new version. And I thought that that just sounded like a romp riot. Yes. I do like the phrase romp riot, by the way. I don't know. That just came out. So, you know, <laughs> I have no idea what I'm going to draw. Maybe search for a little bit of inspiration here. Okay. I'm going to do a uh, drawfee tradition and just wing it. Mm. So I'm just going to get into this. I am a very slow artist, so I'm going to try. Oh, uh, I'm sure that you look like Speedy Gonzalez in comparison. I'm so slow. <laughs> I'm I'm kind of known on Drawfee for drawing these like horrible monster things. I figured out what I'm drawing. Oh, I'm excited. You shouldn't be. My plan is to make a silhouette that will confuse and misdirect you. I'm very easily misdirected. Maybe I should just like try to misdirect you verbally. Look at this uh, mountainside covered in horses. Uh-huh. Then when it comes to the silhouette, you're gonna be like, where are the horses? I don't understand. Are these the horses? And I'll be like, ha ha, there was never a horse. Yeah, it's, you're gonna give me one of those like magic eye things. Oh yeah, it's like just a bunch of static. Yeah. <laughs> Can't tell if what I've done is too easy. Yeah, it's too easy. Don't, don't go too hard on me. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, it was very obvious. Yeah, my first thought was a dolphin. And so I was looking at pictures of dolphins and I was like, yeah, there's no way I can make a confusing dolphin. I'm trying to, okay, I'm actually trying to plan this out now. Okay, I'm excited for this plan. I guess working with you guys made me realize how much further I have to go. Because you're all very good. You're such a talented illustrator. Well, I'm thank like- Thank you. I started what I, what's called a commitment contract, which is where if you don't do something every day for a certain amount of time, then you like lose money. Oh. Or in my case, uh, the, the contract says I have to donate $100 to Scientology. Oh God, Which okay. is something that like for various reasons, I definitely don't want to do. Yeah, I agree. Um, and so every day I've been drawing like three character art pieces. Oh, that's awesome. I hope that doesn't make you think that this is going to be good. <laughs> Because it is very not. I kind of do the same thing with Jacob. So we'll tell each other what we're working on so that the other one will like pre Like you can't back out of a thing that you told a friend about. Yeah, exactly. I'm really not good at like drawing and talking at the same time. Don't worry. I have edited this to make you look fantastic at drawing and talking. Yes, thank You're you. You're so good at that. That's what I need. But that that's awesome that you are doing that thing with your friend. I want to talk about what I'm drawing so bad because <laughs> I drew one thing and it kind of looks like another and both are a little silly. Okay, good. But I can't tell you about it because that ruins the surprise. I just keep thinking about how ridiculous this thing is that I'm drawing. It's so stupid. I don't think I've drawn anything dumber than what I'm doing right now. I'm adding some like little texture detail things, but all of that's going to disappear when I give you the silhouette. I mean, it'll look nice during the process video. Debatable. Just so that everybody watching knows, I don't think this will totally ruin it, but that's a blanket. <laughs> okay, I like hearing the hints. No, you'll never know. You'll never know, you'll have no idea. Okay. How are you turning it into a silhouette? Because I think I'm just gonna like- I work in the, the pencil uh, tool. Oh, oh! So all my lines are closed. <sighs> I use the brush like a noob. Don't worry, Nathan does it too, and I never understand why, because he's like, oh, now coloring is really annoying. I'm like, uh-huh. This is the dumbest thing I've ever drawn in my life. The more time you're leaving me with this. Well, I didn't, I was an idiot and I didn't use the pencil tool, so I can't just fill bucket this. <laughs> okay, that's fair. Oh my goodness. I'm so excited to see what you turn this into. Oh my goodness, what have you given me? I'm actually like giddy with excitement because it's just like, this is so silly. <laughs> So I'm going to share my screen with you. Oh, now the easy part, I just get to watch and laugh. <laughs> I have the hard part, which is figuring out what this is. Okay, I'm just gonna get into this. I'm gonna do this drawfee style and just have at it. Some kind of foot, yeah, good. <laughs> A good foot. Now you know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking like these are a set of eyebrows. Okay. Right? 
Right. So what I'm seeing right here is like a bit of a Wario situation. Look at this. Look at this lopsided Wario man. <laughs> this is not my intention going into this, by the way. Oops, it's a Wario now. So yeah, so he has, these are his cheeks, obviously. Correct. Yeah, obviously. Oh, and here's his little, his little clown party hat. It's like he's ready for a party. It's Wario's birthday. I was gonna put those like exact same spots. But then I, I didn't. I mean, this is this is obviously what you originally drew, right? I'm sort of delighted by how not too far off you are. Yeah? I mean, you've just made it a thousand times better. Oh. What do I do with this, huh? He's got he's got a really round arm here. And th yeah, and then he's got his, his tiny little hand here. He's like, who, me? Yes, this is Wario. This is new Wario. It looks like he's getting ready to slap someone. What do you mean I'm not Wario? Come over here, I slap you. <laughs> <laughs> Wario slap. It's the new WarioWare game. Oh, oh, you know what? I just realized he has many legs. I mean, that's canon, right? That's just how Wario looks. <laughs> right, yeah. Super Smash Brothers, Wario scuttles around like a crab. <gasps> is that what this is? <laughs> <laughs> what have I done? He has one regular human arm, however. As most crab people do. He is also wearing like a little, a little tux. I don't think it can get any better than that. Yeah, I think this is Wario at the beach. That's what I drew. Oh. I was going for like a, like a wizard in an old folks home, but you have made it so much better. I mean, <laughs> this is also excellent. I do like that he looks like he's, he's a little bit playing the bongos. Yeah, I mean. I know that's the couch. I tried to make a big fluffy, like lazy boy yeah. chair, but maybe it's lazy boy's new model that comes with, you know, built in bongos. I was kind of hoping that you'd turn mine into a horse. <laughs> Uh, if I was any good at drawing horses, maybe. I gave you a hard one, and I'm sorry. Oh, jeez. Yeah, good luck with this one. I mean, I don't know what's going on over here. Yeah, no, it's, uh... But I'm not super excited about that. <laughs> it's a very dynamic silhouette. I, I'm excited about yes. that. I can say that I did not draw anything dirty. I mean, I didn't think that you would, but now I'm second guessing. <laughs> You thought you knew me. I mean, I'm just gonna like start. This has like some suckers on it because it's clearly a tentacle. Okay, yeah. They're on like uh, some kind of like beach. For sure. Because that's where things with tentacles stay. Uh, I'm not sure exactly where this is going, but you know, I'm gonna take your advice and just start. Okay. There's clearly like an ice cream cone over here. It's so hard not to say what I have drawn. Real talk though, did I at least get like the foot right? You did. I will say that what I have drawn is just a uh, complete gobbledygook. Okay. It is a very strange thing that I have drawn. So does this tentacle monster thing just have one human leg? Yeah, this is really more of a puzzle than anything. I, I just have yeah, these- Yeah, it really is. It's like I walked into a crime scene and I have to take what <laughs> little information I have to try to piece together what happened. And there's uh -huh. like, you know, there's little body parts everywhere. Ginger Pale is just hanging out off to the side yeah. there. You know, like how kids will draw things and then they label it because they're not totally sure you're gonna be able to tell what it is. I feel the need to start labeling this. This is right. the chair. Um, <laughs> This is like another knee. Yeah. Um, it could be a children's drawing or a political cartoon. Oh yeah, okay. So it's like, this is taxes. Yeah, <laughs> the uh, ice cream is uh, democracy. I don't really know how to draw tentacles. They kind of just come out of a weird base. It also, now it kind of looks like teeth and it looks like we're looking at stuff coming out of a mouth. Oh yeah. Which is kind of fun. Oh, so just like a monster came right up out of the sand. Yes. And it was like, ah, oh, I'm gonna eat ginger pale and his giant ice cream. And this human that was just walking by. Yeah, and so this human is just getting sucked in. Yeah. It's got, it's got tentacle teeth and weird little like mouth nubs. Yes. And then Ginger Pale is just cool with it. I like that a lot. Welcome to the Drawfee secret, which is just keep drawing until something makes sense at some point. And you know, with an ice cream this big, you basically, you knew you were gonna get devoured by a giant tentacle mouth monster. I mean, really? I mean, I, mean, I got the know, flip flop there. You did, and, and the other leg. This is in fact the other leg. Okay. I gave you something very confusing. So you did an excellent job. That's such a good picture. <laughs> <laughs> Like well, just, thank you. just these like lettuce legs. Does he yes, have a name? Let lettuce arms. I don't know. I feel like his name should be like Jeffrey. Yeah, with a face like that. Hello, I'm 
I'm Jeffrey. Thank you so much for coming onto my channel and making these horrible monstrosities with me. Yours weren't. Mine could use some work. I mean, you know, my, my crab Wario. Some would say it's a monstrosity. Uh, I had a really excellent time. Yeah, this was a lot of fun. And thank you for letting me come onto your channel and draw some stuff. I'm going to put a link either on the screen right about now or somewhere in the description where everybody can go check out the thing that uh, I did over on Drawfee, which was a lot of fun. I don't really have an outro, but, um, j uh, bye. <laughs>